Hi, welcome to Previously on the Screeviously. Welcome to Previously on the Screeviously. Wendy and I were just talking about my face, the pimple, there it is. Anything else that needs addressing? And we don't have to do, I don't think you can pop a pimple on YouTube. I, ugh, no. Um, I mean, that's like a whole different unless genre. <laughs> you want me to play Dr. Pimple Popper that, on this season of Previously right. and Previously on the Zit. Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, I have some news. Channel news? <laughs> Secondhand saw that Siesta Key is back. <laughs> We've been watching Siesta Key. No, we haven't. The new season of Siesta Key, yes, we've been watching. I fall, I fell asleep. No, but Wait. you've seen. Like, you can't break. It's not channel news, because you've seen. I totally forgot. <laughs> now you know. <laughs> I watched. And you're like, how can I get out of this? We started it really late, and I fell asleep in the middle of it, and we didn't finish the first episode, we right? Have. I think we've, I have blacked it took, out. It took us three nights to finish the first episode, but we did, and we're somewhere <laughs> in the second episode. <laughs> Um, Anyways, I saw on someone else's story that it was back, and it was news to me. <laughs> Actual channel news, <laughs> and like totally um, apropos of that, is that we are we have permission to do Siesta Key, and right. like that is right now what our next show is going to be because we have we have permission to do it, and it's amazing. For all of you who haven't seen Siesta Key or have no idea what we're talking about, Mark Ford and Kevin Lopez, who are who really, like, I don't know because I didn't work on Laguna Beach, but mm -hmm. they're credited as co-EPs or EPs. Like, they were probably the boots on the ground producers of, of Laguna Beach. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I don't know if they worked on the hills. Did you ever meet them? The George... Mark Ford and Kevin Lopez, I no. think. So, I don't know what they did not on the hills. Maybe they stayed on to do Laguna Beach season four and then Newport Harbor, but they do Siesta Key, and it's amazing. Like, it looks great. Same director as the hills. Yeah, uh -huh. right. Yeah. Um, it has great music. Like, Tom Dannon, who I've worked with, is like a... a when he was an editor as an EP and like great in post. The drama is all real and has some of the most insane characters ever. So I'm so excited for at least the first couple seasons of that show because yeah. they are amazing. Let's get into it. Let's do it. Previously on the Scraviously. Kendra tried to cover up her hookup with Cameron. You know I did not hook up with him. Whatever. But the rumors finally caught up with her on Valentine's Day. I'm with you. It's not working. And Tyler dumped Kendra. No, you flat out lied. Do you want me to leave? Is there a problem with that? Okay, so we're done. Uh, yeah. yeah. Now it was Cameron's turn to squirm, because Jessica was about to find out. As for me, I had a crush on a new boy, Derek, one of the popular guys. And I was really hoping it would work out, for once. So, where should I rest my <laughs> Actually, oh like, God, this guy. Out with I had a crush on Derek, so I decided to do a scene with Chase to tell him about it. Nice. Yeah, we just like started hanging out like a week ago at a party. We like started talking, and then like the next night he was like, "Do you want to go on a date with me?" And so we're gonna go on a date tonight. How stoked are you? I'm really, really excited. I'm kind of nervous though. Don't worry about it. Just be yourself. Just be mellow. Derek's a good guy. I'm glad. He's manly. Hey, I'm glad yeah. I have your approval. Yeah. He needs a lot. Because, like, there's like, been a few guys older. that, like, you've liked, you know? They're kind of just, like, duds. Hey guys, before we continue and reacting, the merch is available. It's ready. We got sweatsuit, which means sweatshirt and sweatpants. Sweatsuit. A lot of people don't know that. Uh, green, 
gnarly surfer girl on it. I, I, good for a boy or a girl. Runs a little bit oversized, is super, super soft. Really, really cute embroidery. We went high quality. We didn't yes. want to go low quality. This is a high quality merch drop. Laguna Beach tee, which is very reminiscent of a tee I would wear. It's purple. It's got like a neon graphic. It's super You're looking cute. at it. Like, you're looking at yeah, it. You're you looking know it's at cute because it. you're so looking cute. at it with you your eyes. You want it. You want it. Then you ask for it. We gave it to you. Friendship bracelets with regulars on it. So if you're a regular and you want to like walk on down the street and like let other people know that you're a regular, or if you want to know if someone else is a regular when you're walking down the street, you can have a bracelet on. And then finally, <laughs> Socks that are supposed to be like these socks. socks. <laughs> Let me rest my foot on your on your knee. <sighs> yeah, and they'll have a DB right there to remind you to take a deep breath mm -hmm. when you're walking. Okay. Always. We hope you guys enjoy it. Peace and streets. Back to the show. First date. Last date. Oh uh, yeah, because Derek is a dick bag. Oh really? I mean, he's been in past episodes. Coffee clutch. Oh, You're Emily's spilling. back. You're level headed yeah. Emily. So, how's Europe? Europe? What is with these the, these vague trips to Europe? They did it on the hill. She's like, I'm going to Europe. People, like, where are you going? <laughs> After high school, that was like a thing. Sometimes parents sent you on like a little trip to Europe before That's true. college. She probably got the Euro Rail Pass and went to a lot of different yeah. places. Fine. You're fine, like 18. Fine. Your parents send you out before college. Blah blah blah. Totally. Had a lot of fun, but. Come back home to drama. <laughs> Duh. Cameron. We hooked up with Kendra on Winter Formal. Have you talked to him about it? She's so stupid. Ew. He hooked up with her on Winter Formal, like, like on top of it? Like on the night of it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get your prepositions wrong around me. She's so stupid. She hooks gross. up with Cameron while she's going out with Tyler, trying to pursue Cameron. It's like, why? So you can have drama in your life and have something to talk about? Like, is your life that, like, boring? You need to find something to talk about? Like, she, like, sits there and talks about me, thinks I don't know it, and then she comes up to me and tries to be nice to my face? Yeah. She's just a fake, stupid, two-faced bitch who's ugly and oh. uses that to raise her self-esteem. Damn! What a run-on sentence <laughs> of dissing. <laughs> Who is she even talking about? Uh, Kendra. Oh, uh, yeah, Kendra. Okay, you can be mad at Kendra. Yeah. How do you feel about Cameron? I don't, we're going to dinner tonight, so we'll see. What are you going to say to him at dinner? I have no idea. Mm. Jessica, come on. What are you up tonight? I'm going out to dinner with Jessica. Good old Jessica. She's like, I have all these thoughts that like need to be said. Okay, you want to play um, ping pong uh, outside in the parking lot of my building structure? It's Look like there's at those 10 pots. parking spots. Where are they? They're that's not just, someone's house. That's a plant shop. Yeah, they're just playing ping pong in the parking lot of a plant shop. But they're nasty. Chick's like fun to hang out with, but she just like always thinks that I'm like hooking up with a bunch of girls. Well, you are kind of a Mac Daddy. I can see, I can see your point. No, Don't say Mac like, Daddy. You have no say in the matter, though, anyways. Yeah, like, dude, just like we were saying, like, she's not putting out the effort. And every time I tell her that, she, like, feeds me a line of bullets. That was a good shot. You don't want to be, like, held down, you're like... Yeah, dude, that's the worst, like, part of the relationship. Them trying to have, like, a mature conversation about relationships it's, it's, is really, it's like... every scene they do, too. It's just, like... Nick's like, don't be upset for like hooking up with three different chicks at the same time. You're totally the man. <laughs> Cameron's like, yeah, that, okay, cool. Let, let's hang out. <laughs> All right, Rocky's house on the bluff. Uh, you know, she doesn't face the ocean, but like. She faces a prairie. She's got a great right. view, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why am I nervous? Why are you Usually not nervous? nervous. No, nervous is I'm big. I'm never nervous. Panicking ever. is not good. I've seen Dirk. Dirk. It's not gonna be a bad date. <laughs> the f is Dirk. Dirk. It's not gonna be a bad date. He's a gentleman. He's a sweetheart. If it's horrible, you tell him that you feel sick and you have to go home. Rocky. You can always it's not pull, gonna happen. So you can always pull the cramps thing because then they don't want to talk about it because they know it's like a girl thing. <laughs> and they get you home as fast as possible. You're gonna have the best date ever. You're gonna come back yeah. and tell me all about it. A lot of people are like, if Raquel was the narrator and Tessa wasn't, that it would have gotten a fourth season. Oh, interesting. Someone said she looks like Erica Jane too. Oh my god. She <laughs> and they're does. like, I can't unsee like, it. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hey Tessa, how are you doing? Oh that okay, that was nice. You better be nice, Dirk. I'll freaking kill you. I will drive to Laguna find you right now. <laughs> 
punch your head off. He looks so much like Rob Deirdre to me. Dirk? Yeah. Looks like Deirdre. His face. Oh, he's got an he's got a Cadillac truck. Are you in a Rich. Nope. Are you really? You have never been there? Never been there. You're gonna love it. Do you like sushi? Yeah, I love sushi. And you've never been to Mosa? No. <laughs> so much sushi. Mosa. 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 One of my favorites, um, the crunchy roll things. I don't know what they're called here, though. Crunchy roll. Yeah. I got one already for you. That's how good I am. Oh, OK. He's being nice. How much do you go here? I come here all the time. I came with, like, Kendra, Cammy, Candice, and, like, all those girls one night. Why don't, you don't hang out with any of them, do you? No segment. I used to be like good friends with all of them, but but we just stopped hanging out. I got really sick that one year. What happened with that? Mm -hmm. Um, I got allergic reaction to like this medicine I was taking. You don't have to talk about it. No, it's fine. But the hospital I was there for like three weeks. Then I came out of the hospital and like some of them saw me and like once, and then they just didn't call me anymore, kind of ditched me. That's so weak. Girls are mean. You're a strong girl, Tess. I didn't realize. Thank you. Some of those girls can be like complete bitches sometimes. I'm never hanging out with them again. <laughs> what are you thinking about? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah. Like, Cameron does not. <laughs> oh, God. It's He's like, I know. So many different directions. Oh, Sonny said he like wanted mine? a mohawk. <laughs> oh, gosh. He went like this, he went like this, and then he went like this. And then he was like, check. Plus. What are you thinking about? You hang out after this? Mm-hmm. And then when you go to your rager and hook up with girls, I'm going to go to bed. I'd argue with you, but you just say the same things over and over. It's because you have no argument. I do have an argument. You have no argument whatsoever. <laughs> Dude, I hate the way she interacts. Like, this play fighting. But, like, you're upset. Be upset. She Don't... just can't be open. She's just being so passive about the whole thing. <sighs> Word. How do you not have an argument? All you do is, like, nag me. I'm not nagging you at all. <laughs> yeah, you are. I could, it's, it'd be nagging if it wasn't true. It's not true, though. And why does it matter if it is anyways? Which it's not. It's so confusing. Mm. It's so uh, gaslighting. Oof. Or, like... Oof. We, we don't have to take either one of these people's sides, by the way. We could just, like, the way they're both, you they're know... They're both behaving Cam poorly. Cameron, obviously... <laughs> You know, Jessica has a point, she's going about it the wrong way, but like... He's manipulating her into totally. thinking it's her. Ugh. You're off like doing God knows what, like in like Europe. I've been completely honest with you and told you everything I've done and I've never done anything. I've been completely honest with you too. Uh-huh. Are you going to tell me about Kendra? Or are you going to keep it a secret? You don't say the things that you say to me and then go and hook up with someone right afterwards. You yeah, just don't. Don't say it with a smile. Right. Yeah. You can't That's... argue that because it's not. Alright. Mm -hmm. It's whatever. You always have to like bring it up and like instigate a fight. It's, I'm not trying to get in a fight with you at all. I'm not trying to fight at all. You just like think it's fun to like. I don't think it's fun. I don't think it's fun. I don't think it's fun. I don't think it's fun either. I'm just like past like the whole like let's flirt about the girls you hook up with. Like, let's flirt about the girls. You're not... totally like flirty like fighting me right now and like I'm over it. So she's getting called out for her passive aggressiveness, uh -huh, but uh -huh. but he is. Um, he is avoiding his obvious wrongdoing. Mm -hmm. I'm not flirty fighting you at all. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Actually, you are. Uh, we're over it. Done. Over your relationship? No, this is how they just keep on going around in circles. This is my favorite sushi I've ever had. It's so good. Talking about the date. When are we coming back? <laughs> Soon. Thanks for taking me. I had a good time. It's not over yet. We're gonna go hang out. Yeah. yeah. All right, Derek. Aww, good. Cute. Derek, who was a jerk in the last episode, was nice here. He's back to even with me. He's a teenager. Yeah, I won't punch him in the face if I see him. <laughs> Do you really want to come over or not? Yeah. I thought you didn't want to or something. No, yeah, I want to go to your house. Probably, probably beat me up. Yeah, get out of the shot! <laughs>
That would be my job, just some behind the scenes as like a field producer, like standing behind the cameraman, like you'd be like, eh, get out, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. Like if you're not getting them to, or reminding them the beats they need to hit, you're just trying to make it look nice. So how are things, sir? It's good. Just got home. You okay. today? What do we think how of Cameron's house? No. I don't really like that style. So I was with it's you and Jessica. Dark. I don't know. Got in a big fight last night, and I was just like, I don't know. I pretty much just don't feel the way I used to, you yeah. know? And like what I told her was, I was just like, I don't feel like as strongly like towards you as I once did. You should like go out and like meet other people and stuff. So basically you kind of told her that you kind of want to do your own thing? Yeah, she was bummed, but I'm not gonna like not, I'm not gonna like and lie she, to her. Yeah, you don't want to lead her on. You I'm know? not gonna lead her on. Yeah. Now you've decided that? Yeah, I just got home. I gotta take a shower and go chill with her. Tell her what's the deal. So what should I say to Cameron today when I see him? So what exactly happened with you and Cameron? Is it a story that you not talk about it? I don't know. He got really, really mad at me. He's kind of like, like, I'm always gonna care about you, I'm always gonna love you, I'm always gonna this, da 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 da. He's like, but I'm not like in love with you anymore. And I was like, we were like going to the park to talk. It's a breakup, dog. Everything always happens at the park. We went to the park before, it was really cute. Now this time's not gonna be cute. Yeah, no. She knows. They've been saying I love you to each other. Cameron, you f***ed up, Yeah, dude. that's not okay. No, obviously, yeah, obviously that's not okay. We went to Mothon. I've never been there before, so I had him order for me. <laughs> oh, I love that when they do that. Especially when they do it well, you know, they order what you like. Yeah. What'd you talk about? We just talked about everything, like what friends like are my good friends and like who I hang out with and, and which ones aren't. Yeah. Which ones aren't my friends? I like him. Do you? Yes. You've already decided? Yeah. I decide quickly. You know me. Yeah, thank you. Oh, my little Tessa. You have a boy. I'm happy for you. Okay, all right. Cool. Oh, that's super cute. Oh. <laughs> Constantly you're doing that. Oh, I like it. That's so cute. I really, really like this. It's super cute. And I like baggy sweatshirts because they're looking a little hefty these days. Oh. Anyways, as you were saying. About oh, Derek and Tessa? <laughs> yeah. I just want to know if it's like official if they're going out or if it's just like they're like dating. Well, I asked if they were dating. I said, I like, asked, are you guys, guys going out? I said, are you guys together? Yeah. And he like shook his head and like looked at me like you're such a bitch for asking these questions. Yeah. And I like to tell you, those guys like always talk to all of those girls. So I never really understood like why they started hanging out with them. I don't think they do. What? Hang out with them. Yeah, they do. Like Raquel and like Tessa. Like, how do you think that like Derek and I can't see them together though, at all. I know it's really weird. Oh, uh, they're like Derek losing their boy just... crew. Mm -hmm. She oh, with Derek. It's gonna hit the fan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she I'm likes Derek. Face. That is four thousand two hundred eighty. No. No. All China wall. <laughs> oh, that's exactly. expensive. Shopping's over for you, yeah, right? Exactly. No. <laughs> I'm in shock. <laughs> Their sweatshirts and trucker hats? I mean, those those things at Fred Siegel, everybody knows this phase. Those things were all like rhinestone. People were, it was a racket. It was ridiculous what people were paying for, like rhinestone, torn, like washed, vintage-y looking, chrome heartsy things. Like a sweatshirt for like $900. Oh my God. I mean, obviously I never wore it any of that stuff, so I have no idea. That just shook my world. <sighs> also on top of that, <laughs> um, so Cammy likes Derek, and Derek is now dating Tessa, so like, if Cammy comes for Tessa, I'm gonna freak out. Yeah, freak out. But then they just freak dropped out. this $4,000 bomb on me. <laughs> like, Boy. what credit card is she using to pay for like that? Like they just give them the credit card? Don't look at the camera. Sometimes I know just where you <sighs> hey, I'm, I'm nervous because I'm about to break up with you. Had a good day? Mm -hmm. It's cold. It is kind of cold. So awkward. It's not my fault it's awkward. <laughs> oh my god, it's not. It's my fault, huh? Why would it be your fault? Wouldn't it be? Dude. Don't get mad. I'm not getting, why would I get mad? I don't know. Your little dude sound always means you get mad. So don't get I didn't mad. say dude, did I? Yeah. You do. You say dude every time you get like mad and are ready to say a comment, but really? then don't say it. Wow, you really know me, don't you? <laughs> oh no. 
I'm not gonna treat you any differently. What? You have to treat me differently. You can't treat me the same way that you used to. Things were meant to be different because you want them to be different. You can't be the same. No, I'm not like changing anything. All I said was I just like, I don't want you to like miss out on any opportunities. You like... can't turn it around and blame it on me. It's <laughs> you, it's you and what you want. It's not about me, so don't turn it around and say it's about me. Because not... it's not. I'm not saying it's like. You just said you don't want me to miss out on opportunities. I didn't. No, I just like, I don't know. I don't want you to like cut me out of your life. <laughs> I won't. No, I just like, I don't know. Our relationship doesn't work anymore. So it's over. Yeah. Jess, you're better off, dog. Totally. I'm psyched for this barbecue. I'm psyched. I'm psyched on wieners, dude. Bratwurst. We should grill some steaks. We should. Hey, Deer Rock. What's cracking? What's going on with you and your lady friend? Deer Rock. I thought they called him Deer Deck, and I was like, what? Is he related to Rob Deer Deck? <laughs> I'd like a little insight, Derek. Nick wants Ooh, insight, and I do too. Nick, you know, I don't want to be too honest <laughs> with you. <laughs> oh, oh, that's, stop, is Derek. that the breakup that's a killer punch? stop. Athlete. Spill the beans, son. Dude, I'm having a good time. I like her. I think she likes me. She's coming to my barbecue. Yeah, you have to, she's your girlfriend. The thing is, I'm not like, like I'm having a good time with her now and then. All these people start talking and saying things. See, that's the problem with like going out with somebody. I never went out with Jessica. You did? No, you I didn't. Why that, Cam? I Come didn't go on, out with her. Man. No, I didn't. I never went out with her. You were going out. No, you, were, I, you guys I, were going to get married. You weren't going out there. You were like seeing her. I wasn't going out there. I was just seeing her. Ugh. Oh, Assholes. Like, <laughs> these guys, they, they like, they, they want, they like a girl, they go on a date, and then their dickhead friends are like, oh, you're dating her? And like, make them feel weird about it. And now they're like, I'm not dating her, I'm gonna ignore her. Like, it's, it's because of their dickhead friends. It's because of each of their insecurities as well as, yeah. Right, they just wanna fit in with their, you know, they don't wanna lose their guy friends. Mm -hmm. And like, their guy friends are such, they're jealous. Mm -hmm. Nick, I'm coming for you, dude. Don't, you know, wanna have a relationship with her. Only because I just, you know. Don't feel the same way she does. So. I'm not gonna like lead her on, you know. At least I took the initiative and ended like something that wasn't working. Yeah, you only cheated on her twice before you did it. You <laughs> f head. I'm kind of nervous about this barbecue. You're coming later, right? Definitely coming later. It's a valley. It looks like. Mm, that's pretty out here, isn't it? Nice sit on this. Oh, that scares me. So with Kendra and Kami, think of this. Oh, really? Oh, Going full. Turf. I know. People are like, oh, watch out. They might, like, sabotage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Big surprise there. But, like, why? Like, what is the point? This is crazy. So she's going to Derek's barbecue. Mm -hmm. And, like, Kendra and Kami are going to be there. And Raquel can't make it until later? And, but she's going as his girlfriend. I so, know, like, but hopefully he'll oh, he better. take care of he her. He better. In some sick way, it gives them pleasure to see other people fall. I guess so. Hot take this season is like is better than a lot of the other ones. Mm -hmm. Like, it has real drama. It has good and bad. Like people are dating and breaking up. Like, dude, if Derek has ocean views, oh my god, he does. That chicken looks Dreamy. delicious. Excellent, Derek. Can I do you for some meat? Any of you guys? <laughs> what time's time's it coming? Ew. Oh, that was mean. She's missing dinner. Yeah, she's not fashionably laid anymore. We're so pissed, Derek. I should break up with her for that. That sounds like a good idea, though. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Derek didn't stand up for her. And Cameron should, too. Like. Speak of the devil. Ew. Hello. How you been, Tessa? I'm good. How are you? Still Hello. This is boring. You want to go? What? You guys are leaving? It's been a long weekend. I get it, man. People get full and then they leave. We come, we eat, we conquer. So we can't entertain you guys. Nice seeing you. Enjoy your barbecue. Bye, Nick. Nice seeing you. Bye, Lava. Take care. Mm -hmm. See you later. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Lava. Get out of here, you hyenas. You enjoyed that, didn't you? <laughs> hey, no. Good. You missed dinner. Okay, Kendra, let's go. There's still a lot left, if you want. I'm sorry. 
Like, I'm trying to think of how that could have been edited, like, you know. That they didn't leave, Like, right. they could have stuck around and talked, and then they could have left and just showed them leaving. Mm-hmm. But, like, they were still eating the food that they started with. It seemed like they got, they left mm. as soon as she got there. So, like, from am pissed. She literally has the personality of a wet rat. Oh, my God. She's, like, talking to a wall. How are those oh, girls? Why'd they leave? So those hoodlums, man. They show up, they grind our food, and then they bail. It's like, come on, have a little class, man. Hey, Nick. Where do we eat? We can let Tessa and Derek hang out over there. No, Shut up, Nick. <laughs> Don't mind us. <laughs> Proceed anyways, back to what we were saying. <laughs> what was that, Cameron? I'm just kidding. <laughs> now just stare at him. Awkward. Oh, my it's God, right. I hate the this worst. guy. It's the worst. Oh, thank yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> Down here. Have you guys ever watched that show Rocky and Bullwinkle Dog. when you were little? That's what we decided. Raquel, how are you doing? Oh, it's a boy fest. Are you hungry, Raquel? No. Well, no, I just had sushi. I'll take your coat for you. Where'd you get a sushi? Happy sushi. Where's that? You don't know where it's happy. It's like by that little barbershop. He only eats that Moson. <laughs> I only do Moson. You want to go in the kitchen with me, Cameron? No. I'll get home with you. Okay. We'll leave you out here. Okay. I saw Kendra, Cami, and Nikki for about three seconds. They came and left? They came, ate, and left. Random. Yeah, they're lost. What about you? You seem quiet. Are you okay? Oh my god, you look sad for a minute. I don't know, like being with his friends, like after I know that they like rag on him for having a girlfriend is like weird. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but you can't think of it like that, you know, because they're only doing it. Because they're jealous, does that? I'll try not to. I'll get over it, but just like right now, you know? Mm-hmm. Totally. Bothers me. You can't think about it. This is like the beginning of a huge adventure. ADR? Yeah. <laughs> that sounded like my voice. They're like, hey, what? can you just pop in and do Rocky's line real quick? <laughs> Next on Laguna Beach. Oh, the relationship is getting way too exclusive. I don't want that, dude. Oh, well, he's just super pressured right now. I don't want to lose him. I'm just confused. I don't even know if I want to be in like a gnarly relationship like this. Like, and that's what you want. You excited for the bonfire tomorrow night? <laughs> there you go. What is this wall here, Alex? I think he's telling her to kick rocks right now. Well, if you're completely unhappy with me, then you need to let me go. <sighs> they were not meant to be together. Same thing. He got ragged on for having a girlfriend and you know started to believe yeah that he shouldn't have one right that he like, didn't oh, really like her i'm only getting made fun of feelings. i better get yeah. rid of this girlfriend yeah thank you guys thank for you. joining us pumped to go into the next one we'll pumped. see you next time i need another banana time out let's go in a bathroom situation